just this promise we're back right where we left off. We have not gotten a second to breathe. This is the same breath as the last episode. Uh, it's still Yuri Wantanabe. She's still Russian, if you're curious. Um, she still hasn't changed. She's still the same old woman she was the yeah. episode before. The hard-working lady that she she has been known to be. I hope she doesn't turn out to be like an asshole or something. I wouldn't know. I've only played 5% of the game. You mean like Aunt May from the Sam Raimi series Spider-Man? Yes, just like that. Oh. Anyway, so last, last episode we were talking about uh, funny lines in movies that... Probably aren't supposed to be as funny as we find them, <laughs> but, but they, fucking but are. they just, just murder you on the spot. And, uh, well, I don't want to ruin yours. You, you go ahead and start with the orange oh, slices. Oh, God. So, <laughs> like, th th this line has no purpose in being in Avengers. Is it Avengers? It's Avengers. Oh, yeah, no, it's first... not. It's Captain America Civil War. It's, it's in... Avengers, pretty much. But yeah. I get you. Civil War. Yeah. It's an Avengers Civil War, and there's this one line in which Ant-Man, he's big, and then Spider-Man is like, Oh, why don't we do the whole, like, that one old Star Wars movie thing where he, like, gets wrapped up, and they kill him. And they, that's until they destroy him, and, and I'm like, well, yeah, it's actually pretty cool. So then they do that, and then, like, once they collapse down uh, Ant-Man, he takes off his helmet, and he's like... Does anybody have any orange slices? <laughs> and it's the stupidest thing ever. Like, that line does not belong at all in that movie. And I'm glad it's in that movie. <laughs> like, there is, like, no good reason for that to be in there. It is so out of character and so out of place. Yeah. But, uh, there's, there's only a couple of those lines that I can think of that, like, that bring me as much enjoyment as orange slices does for you. Uh, there was... What was it? It was Zootopia. There we go. Zootopia. Uh, my wife really, really wanted to watch it, and I was like, okay. And like, we watched it, and it ended up being a really cool movie. Like, I really liked it. Yeah. But there's a scene in it where, um, I don't know if this guy is a rat or if he's a weasel or something, and they're trying to figure out like why he sold this guy out, like why he told them something or other, and he says they offered me the one thing I couldn't refuse, money, and like. <laughs> It's it's so dumb. The timing's not even that great, but like I laughed so hard that people in the movie theater were looking at me, and I didn't care. Like it was the funniest thing, and I was mad that these people didn't appreciate the greatness that was that one single line. Oh, dude, no. you got murked. Well, that's the end of the game. Yeah. So catch us next time. This was a uh, this is the great Spoderman. As you can see, he's falling to his doom after they've thrown him off the building. Uh, what are they like? I was thinking of another movie, but I can't, I can't remember it now. I have, honest to God, the memory of a goldfish. If I'm not actively talking about something I'm thinking yeah. of, I can't, for the life of me, remember what I was gonna say five minutes ago. Yeah, well, you, you, were, you, were, you were talking about, uh, Zootopia and the line. Yeah, well, th that, that was the line. And that was pretty much it from that movie. There was one more movie that I, I can't remember what it was, but it was just another one of those moments where it was, it was not funny. It was not supposed to be funny. And I, look at that fat fuck. That's Kingpin. That is Kingpin. Though he usually wears a white suit, doesn't he? Usually. In the 90s show he did. Yeah, that's what I think of him as. From like the, the radioactive Spider-Man. Oh, yeah. With a purple tie, that's right, yeah. He's still got his purple tie, but... I know his goons are dressed in purple too. He had a, he had a mutation though, didn't he? Yeah. I want to say like he couldn't be, knocked unconscious or something like that. Look around. Damn, dude, you wrecked shop on that one dude, and then these guys all punched you. So cinematic. This is pretty like, flowy. They they kind of jittery in like odd directions every now and then. But for the most part, this combat's really cool. Oh yeah, no, dude, it's super fluid. It's literally just two buttons. Oh well, that's fine. I think simplicity, especially in games like this where it's like the Arkham Asylum games or those Batman games where yeah. part of it's moving, you can use a gadget to beat him, or oh shit, you better not... Oh, you recover when you're hidden? Oh, is, is no. Is that what the deal is? No, I... 
there, there's a little special ability you can use. You just press down on the D-pad and it's like, oh, well, I guess you're safe now. <laughs> now I got heals. Give me the he Oh, speaking of heals, uh, later on you gotta check out the, uh, so we're playing D&D &D for those of you guys who have been keeping up with us. We haven't started yet. Uh, we have not. We got us this weekend, which I'm excited about. And I've been trying to figure out, like, how to handle health potions and stuff like that, because I want the stakes to be sort of high. I want there to be a little bit of stress in these, like, fights and stuff. Um, so everyone's got, like, one health potion that they got with them, and it's like a peripheral so they can see. Uh, we were out and about at, I, I guess I don't want to say the store name, otherwise they'll sue us. Anyways, we're out and about at this place that sells crafty stuff, and I saw these little, uh, bottles. And I was like, how cool would it be to fill these up with, like, a little colored Gatorade so that they look, like, potion-y? Like, and then, like, whenever you have to do it to, like, represent that it it takes a turn to drink the potion, uh, you gotta actually drink the thing. Yeah, so, like, like, like a potion, like, like in Fortnite? Yeah, potions like in Fortnite. They made it a real thing. Those absolute mad men. That's fucking weird. Can't believe uh, the potions right. from Fortnite are a real thing. Oh, dang, look at that. This is, uh... He'll never be able to lift it. I have no faith in this twink. Dang. Dude, your ability to continuously press square is very heroic. It's unmatched. And that's kind of like an homage to the, uh... What was it? Well, Homecoming did an homage to it as well. Yeah, Homecoming did. Where, like, Spider-Man got crushed under a building and... He had to lift it off himself. That was hard to watch. Dude, it was such an intense scene. That was hard to watch. God, it was such an intense scene. You know what I like about Spider-Man 2? As opposed to, like, Batman, where when he does his stealth stuff and goes through vents, yeah. uh, Batman just breaks the shit out of the wall. And Spider-Man doesn't. <laughs> Spider-Man's just like, nah, I'm just gonna walk in like a normal human being and not blow random shit up. I think Spider-Man's mentality is I can't afford to pay for a single vent, so they're all gonna <laughs> be nice exactly the way I left them. Whoa, boyo. You almost got wrecked with a missile. No, dude. It was slow enough for me to see it coming and miss it. That's because of your spider sense. You can sense spiders in the area. Or at least that's how I've been told it operates. Dang, dude. He's aware of every eight-legged critter within. Playing Spider-Man. In which he is all spiders. <laughs> yeah, he's just a suit full of sentient spiders. <laughs> he is all spiders and man. Oh my god, go back to that guy. Hang on. How you doing? Dang, dude. What fucking, fucking hanging cool out there. Ass Look at his the shoulders! Shoulder! Oh my oh. god! Oh, he... What the fuck? fuck is that? Oh, that's pretty... No, you can't hit him anymore. His ragdoll physics ended. Oh, he's just... Stuck. He's just there. He looks like a statue right next to your other guy. Dude, you're almost out of web shooters. I'd be careful. Nah, they they, they come back. Oh, they grow. How the bomb squad guys yeah, get through this? But they're a finite supply. Uh, Does he quote pee? Unquote. Does he pee out Set web down. shooters? I've got enough for everybody. Or is it just a way so you don't constantly use web? So you don't constantly use web. Okay. Kick his ass, sea bass. Oh wow! So that like that red line indicates when they're gonna attack you or shoot at you. Uh it, yeah, it's like the last second possible to dodge before you actually get like okay. hit, wrecked. Bomb squad must be <laughs> like, it's like, like, I hit him pretty hard. He was just like, nah, fuck yeah, that. I'm just, just like, gonna, like, right, I'm just gonna act chill. Oh, this is no need to end. hit me anymore. I am, uh, I'm done. You guys all right? That was a little excessive. Not gonna lie. Well, we're just about to call for backup, but we called for spider. The spider signal was in the air. Oh, oh liars. no! Is this the end of the game? Damn, Spider-Man's clever. He knocked out that one dude with a single web. Alright, make quick work of these guys, man. You're on... Oh. We're on borrowed time. Oof. I'm sure Spider-Man's got all kinds of witty banter. But... 
I don't know where I was going with that. I kind of froze midway. Uh, I thought it was going to be very clever and it turned out I was just stupid. It's okay, I forgive you. Everybody makes mistakes. Everybody has those days. Nobody told me there'd be days like this. Get that sucker. Dude, I've been like... Really bad about it on collecting miniatures and stuff lately. Collecting miniatures? I never collected miniatures. Yeah. I don't think I ever collected anything. There was actually like a point where, like, when the amiibos were really huge. Yeah. Like, that was my shit. That I mean, summer. Yeah. Like, two summers ago. And Ooh. then I got bored because it was a lot of money and I realized I couldn't keep up with it. And then it turns out I really wanted them because they were rare. And then only after that. I'm right outside his and room. only after that Take were they down. like now. with pleasure did I like lose interest because then they started like releasing them in mass quantities all over the place so those that were rare aren't really rare at all anymore because they're all like uh, super common yeah. and I was like well I don't want these so I just gave them all to my brother and I just stopped caring the bubble burst yeah I was like dang Right. I didn't really been about memoirs? that. I'm kind of like that about like the, the Funko the figures, but just like the Overwatch ones, and then the specifically just the tank ones. Wrong. Other than that, I don't care for that. <laughs> <laughs> so I only want like six of them. Of the pops, yeah. And some of them I uh, haven't even come out yet. But whenever they come out, I might get them. Of weird. all the tank characters. Okay. I'm a tank main. You're a tank main. Yeah. And well, with that, uh... Let's see what Kingpin's evil plan is. Why is he not super fat? Because he's buff, dude. How is he going to beat the shit out of Spider-Man? With his giant fat. Oh, he just swallows him up. <laughs> gets punched. He just, like, just swallows him up. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, nope. Oh, Alright, there you go. I was about to say, if that's all you have to do to beat these things, that's pretty... Pretty silly. Web, 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 web. You have a sickness? Try some WebMD. Oh! Because he's Spider Man. I will destroy you. Fuck. See, I knew he had some kind of strong. Ah, uh, right in your stupid face. So he's just super strong. That's that's his deal, yo, right? Basically, I don't think he's much anything else. So does he then become the Rhino? You're no. out of your depth, the Rhino's is someone completely different. Ah, uh, if, if if I remember correctly, is he the Shredder? The Shredder? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is why you guys stay tuning in this long. The really really stupid jokes. <laughs> Fucking just becomes the oh, shredder. Oh shit! Oh! That wasn't part of the plan. Whoop his ass, sea bass. Wait, now you're in a totally different place. Fuck, dude. dude, the jugger Batman strength. Shit. The juggernaut's not taking it easy on you. Is he the fatter not? Cause he's the fat juggernaut. Yeah. And he can't be stopped. The same to you. You know what to do, man. His name is Fisk, which rhymes with fish, because he's stupid. Let this video run long. Okay. This is too cinematic to be broken up into two episodes. So there. Whoa! Oh, whoa! Fuck. Wow! He is not fucking around with you. Watch out, Fisk is gonna try to what fisk- What the fuck?! Damn! He's gonna try to fisk you, dude. Oof. Oh, shit! Oh. Yeah, that's- that's out cold. Yeah, that's- that's where we end it. We'll pick it up from this spot and we'll see you guys next time.